Greetings in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Welcome to the channel and welcome to yet another conference. All honor, glory, and praise be to our one and only Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Well, I have a quick word for somebody out there. Father is waiting patiently on the throne. Father is waiting patiently on the throne the throne on his throne there's nothing for you to worry about there's nothing for anybody to worry about because father is waiting patiently on the throne because he knows he's got this you understand you may not know he's got this but he knows he's got this so he doesn't have to shuffle his feet and be upset set and shift his body and over the things that Satan and his minions are doing down here on this planet and all the obstacles they are creating and all the hindrances and all the injustices and all the hate tactics that the devil and his minions are using against most almost everyone down here because father is waiting patiently on his throne you understand and in due season he is going to render judgment harsh judgment intense judgment upon the heads of the wicked people that do nothing in this world but try to make the lives of other people hard difficult non-productive they create deliberate obstacles in people's way you understand they um don't want you to succeed they don't want you to thrive they don't want you to have anything but trouble in your life but father is waiting patiently on his throne and in due season the wicked is going to pay for everything that they've done in their demonically inspired lives. They're going to pay. And a lot of you may, you know, I don't know if you will live to see it on this side or, or if Father has decided to let you witness it on the other side, meaning it could be um, you viewing from the other side or on the day of judgment. I don't know. That's not my call that's not my business but i will say this that god is a just god he's just and the eyes of the lord are in every place beholding the evil and the good and that no evil deed will go unpunished and for those of you that are being held in captivity for filthy lucre's sake you know gripped and bound under the the uh this matrix the system of this world don't worry about it because those that have you in captivity one day they will be in captivity those that are making your lives a living hell one day they'll be burning in hell if they don't repent and most likely a lot of them probably won't the majority probably won't because a lot of people would like to pl uh, push god out of their minds then that way they don't have to deal with the consequences of their actions or even have the thought of there's a consequence to action but let me tell you something <laughs> every dog has his day and the wicked aren't getting away with anything that they are doing in this world i don't care who they are see with god there is no respect of person you understand god is a just god and um god is sitting on the throne waiting patiently so that's an indication that we should be waiting patiently because whatever it is we're facing, God has already worked it out. It's just that you don't know uh, how he's worked it out and you can't foresee how he's worked it out. But as long as he's worked it out, why not just live your life carefree and trust him? You understand? He, if he navigated you to this planet, he can navigate you through life on this planet and navigate you onto your next destination after your assignment aspires on this planet. So don't worry about it. Father's got it. You understand? And you can live your life in peace and carefree knowing that you don't have to worry about it. Whatever it is, give it to Jesus. Whatever you need, ask him. You know, 
I believe it's his good pleasure to give you the things that you need and want in this life. You understand? Just remember, no matter what you're facing today, this is a word for somebody. God is still on the throne. So there's nothing to worry about. Okay? So with that said, God bless you all until next time. And um, no weapon that is formed against thee shall prosper. I don't care what it is. Bye-bye.